Yo, it's time for Boongo Stray Dog Season 5, Episode 8. I hope you guys are ready for some peak moments, some hype moments, some twists and turns, because that's what Boongo Stray Dogs likes to give us. Let's go. Understood. Atsushi? Yes. Remember, he's supposed to be bringing Taruko to Rampo. <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. You don't have a choice, dude. My goodness. You don't have a choice, dude. Mm hmm Okay. What is she up to? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. And it begins, dude. The heck is Copper Whip? What does that do? Oh, she's gonna turn him young, right? Yeah. Or an old man. Damn, she's making him a baby. <laughs> Turning that sushi back into a toddler, dude. What the heck, bro? Are we gonna have a baby wear tiger running around? <laughs> oh, I forgot about this too, dude. How could I? Kenji got wrecked last episode, dude. Oh, he is a vampire now. Oh, boy. So, wait a second, bro. Does she turn all the people she's going to torture in the children? Because that'd, like, add another crazy layer to her, man. Yo, what the heck is about to happen here? What? Oh. Oh. Oh my goodness, dude. It's like he unlocked more of his strength or something? What is that form, dude? Like I said, bro, this show never ceases to surprise me. I love this damn show, dude. Oh, it took it point blank. He's not all black anymore, though. Oh, but he's still zone. What? What? He like read what's his name's movement. Did he protect it? Yo. Oh my goodness, dude. And that something was Kenji. <laughs> Yo! Oh my goodness, dude. Power of the forces of Mother Nature. Dude, a god, bro. Dude is a god. You really messed up, Techo. Oh, bro, is he gonna actually bust this dude up? Wait. Did he stop himself somehow? Yo, because remember, his best friend was under uh, rubble before. Kenji's crazy, dude. Absolutely crazy character, man. Oh, they're actually gonna team up? Techo is gonna work with him. Oh, he got stabbed, remember? <laughs> I guess these two are down for the count, huh? Yeah, but uh, our boy worked with that that monster, bro. They were the original double, or at least the previous double black. Uh, I'm sure Dazai knows how to handle Chuya. Ango, Ango, okay, okay, that makes sense. That's right, that's right. I forgot Ango said that, right? It's almost like Morse code. Yeah, what's that flaw, bro? Okay, so he must be getting info another way. 
Yeah, how is he doing it, bro? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Finally? I think he's been unhinged this whole time, bro. Oh, is that his goal? He wants to kill the demon? And I guess Chuya would die in the process, right? Oh, that's anti-gifted, isn't it? <laughs> They're gonna use the facility against them, bro. Yes, remember they talked about this last episode, the flooding and all of that. And it's especially it's heavier water, so you can't swim, right? Okay. <laughs> Yo, I love Desai, dude. He's like, I already opened it. Just Desai being Desai. Wait, how are they taken out already? Yo, this... <laughs> dude, 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 stop, bro. Stop with this crypticness, man. I want to know what the hell happened. She? Who's she, bro? Is that a cat? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I thought it was a cat person. Ah. Hence the cat burglar theme. Wow. So she affected the, the prison. Ah. <laughs> Yo! So many working parts at play, dude. Oh, that's true. Oh, that's true! Bro, and nobody knew because time was stopped. I love the use of special abilities in this series, dude. It's so dang good, man. But how do we know? How do we know Fyodor doesn't know this? He seemed pretty surprised before, though. Right? They don't really know what his whole power is, right? He wants to see what his power is, bro. No! 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 I don't give a fuck if you never gave a, got along. Don't kill Chuya, bro. Oh my goodness, this guy is such a troll. Oh my goodness, man, it's like I couldn't think of any. No. No. Meanwhile, I is running around with a vampire sword on his on her back. Uh, I love these two's interactions too, man. They're so good. Bro, that that's that sounds great. But like, what if that doesn't play out the way you want? Then you're done, right? I mean, <laughs> I love their interactions, bro. That's great, but whatever you're gonna do, I'm sure is gonna be easier to deal with than what uh, Fukuchi's doing, though. Then again, we don't want a big vampire outbreak either, but we already have one, dude. So what's the difference? Okay. That's pretty cool. So is the sword, does the sword have sentience, bro? Okay. And that's how Fukuchi uses his ability because technically the sword warped itself to Bram's flesh. And I was wondering how he still has control over the vampires, uh, Fukuchi, but I don't think he does. Somebody made a good point that possibly he put like a... Uh, an original order on it, and that order is still intact, even though he doesn't have the sword, you know? How do we get that away from him, though? How do we get rid of that seal? 
Unless Desai gets his hands on it and nullifies all that shit, dude. But then Bram might die, right? Second time? Who was the what was the first time? Oh, through the head? Oh, he was burned at the stake. So how old is he, bro? Because this is like medieval times. <laughs> You're a vassal, Aya. <laughs> you can't die, bro. <laughs> it's not valuable knowledge. Oh, bro. It's Rashomon, dude. Bro, that show, though, that, dude, the episode's over? Bro. Yo. Bro, how are we going to get out of this, dude? How is she going to get out of this with Bram when I Ghoul Akutagawa's here, bro. Bro. Oh, bro. This, this show's too good, man. This literally felt like five minutes. I love this show. Absolutely love this show, bro. How the hell is Aya gonna survive a run-in a, a run with Vampire Akutagawa, of all people, bro? And if she leaves... Bram is there by himself, and I don't think he can even defend himself in any way, right? So how is that going to play out? Meanwhile, Teruko has Atsushi <laughs> locked up and is ready to torture him to get some info. Like, this is crazy. Chuya and Fyodor might be dead, but I highly doubt Fyodor is dead, and I highly doubt Chuya is dead. I believe that's a misdirect. Plus, Chuya might be able to survive because he's a vampire right now. I don't know about Fyodor, but I'm sure Fyodor has a way out of it, right? I don't think we're going to lose the main villain already, you know what I'm saying? And really, we don't really know what his crime and punish punishment gift does. We never really learned that, right? And I feel like that's what Desai was trying to see in that moment as well, what that gift was, because he doesn't fully know what the gift does either. Another amazing episode. I would love to hear your thoughts on this one down below. As always, thanks for watching, and until next time.